Hey folks, this is Tico here, and welcome back to RimWorld. So at the end of our last episode, we had maybe what was the most amazing battle we have ever had. Just, this was phenomenal. One series a long ways back, I nuked my own base just out of curiosity. That was still not as funny as watching all of these Aeroflit explode all at once. So, good times. Um, moving forward, <laughs> we're going to have a lot of Aerofleet to chop up. Not as many bugs as I would like, but at least we can get this thing, uh, this nutrient paste dispenser... Uh, running again. So one thing that I am going to need to do is that I'm going to need to start making kibble again, and that's going to be restricted to the Aero Fleet. The reason is, um, if I remember all this correctly, and I may not because the last time I looked this up was like beta 19, um, so different uh, food types have different nu uh, nutrient values, right? The problem is, is they come in units. So for example, say an Aero Fleet only wants to eat 0.2 nutrients to fill itself up. Whereas your nutrient paste dispenser gives them, um, let's say, a meal that's worth 1.0. Well, they're going to eat that whole meal, but then a lot of that's going to be wasted. And that's why we blasted through all of our food so fast when I let them in. So kibble is terribly inefficient when it comes to turning ingredients into something else. However, it comes in very small units. Or I could do pemmican, actually. Mm, I'll have to check which one. Um, but I think I'm already set up here to start making kibble again. So they'll be the only ones that have access to that. They will eat just a little bit at a time, and then hopefully we can keep everybody fed and healthy and not starving and all kinds of stuff like that. Probably not. Um, yeah, we'll see. Um, what else does miss? Thing, uh, tentacles for Mort, yes. They're really expensive. All I can make is Bionics, and so they require two advanced components. But we can't just leave Mort laying around. That would be too sad, so we'll get Mort up and moving again. Um, yeah, I probably should have captured this animal and not killed it, but... I don't know, I panicked. <laughs> it happens. And beyond that, uh, go through what weapons we have and on whom. And the next one says, go through all the weapons and use your brain. So, okay, so I went through the weapons. And yeah, we do still have some people using some fairly low-tech weapons, but at the moment, we have other things to do. Oh yeah, and this is why I'm kicking these walls out here, is um, I'm going to need an area back here to put the Aerofleet feeding zone in. So I need some more space again. Yeah, I know. Are you guys restricted inside or not? I can't remember. No, just nobody cares. Sorry. We have a lot of air fleet. If you can make it through to summer, everything will be okay. And if you can't, you will die. I mean, I can't let all of them die, obviously. Actually, you know, this is not a lot of air fleet. You know what? Um, come back into animal normal. I killed most of you already, so <laughs> the least I can do is feed you nutrient paste meals for a little bit. Rose, I wish you weren't the one doing this because you're really slow at cutting these plants. But oh well. My other people are busy. Um, Birdman is up to a 10 on medical. Hooray! 99% surgical chance. Very good. That's really good enough, but 11 would be fine as well. Air botch and stuff. I really need these brought in. I'm giving everyone a chance to sleep overnight, but. Even so. So why are you guys starving? Is really no one coming to help you? Like, you should be able to come down here and, like, eat food. Why is no one, like, saving you? Who's set to be my... Um, who's supposed to be handling? Is it someone who's downed? Can't remember these buttons. Okay, here we go. Handle. No, it's just Kraus. There we go. Yeah, you're feeding pemmican. Good. Good, good, good. Okay, what's up with you guys? Why are you fighting? Uh, let's see here. Insulted his nephew's hardness. Well, hardiness, I'm sorry. Well, whatever. Alright, so I added the zone over here, and I don't think anything but the Aero Fleets can eat this. They've got, there's a two-tile buffer. Um, if I can show you this here real quick. So hopefully I've got this right. So this is animals, see it's two tiles over. Um, Aerofleet covers it entirely. Well, even though Aerofleet's not contiguous, they can move back and forth. Um, so hopefully now, it'll be just the Aerofleet that are coming over. And the horses and stuff sh should be getting fed by this. Let's set this to haul urgently, because none of the stuff is getting done. And I need this done. And it looks like I can change this to no longer have any other meats. Other than insect meat. Ah, hold on. Okay, okay, hold on. Trying to type here. I can't do two things at the same time. 
Okay, research. So good, we've got packaged survival meals done. And then my next one, yeah, is a boring one. We need Starflight Basics. I'm sorry. It's dumb, but we need it. Yeah, like, nobody's killing these, nobody's collecting these, like... Come on, guys. Like, we need this work done. Even if you don't like it, I understand. It's boring. Quest available, huh? Hold on, hold on. Um, a falling shuttle. Okay. Tribes people will attack this shuttle, okay. Ooh, this is tempting. This is really tempting. Honor plus 12 would kick Revnak up over to the next level, right? Um... Okay, so you have eight. So yeah, that would be enough to kick you up to Praetor. Ooh, I'm gonna have to think about that one. At the moment, since you're over here, blow up this ship. Try not to hit anybody who comes past. Yeah, you're one of the people that needs a better gun. But we're working on it. Thank you. And these also need to be hauled urgently. And these need to be hauled urgently. And you can go free. I don't really care about this stuff too much, but I would like to have it inside. Actually, haul that. Okay. A food binge, huh? Well, I don't really care. That's fine. Have fun. Like, my god, this is taking absolutely forever to get all this stuff chopped up. Uh, Birdman. Keep butchering. And this stuff should really not be out here yet. Why has nobody killed this? I mean, I forgot to mark it as finish off. And yes, there's some corpse in there. Inspired Taming. What's your animals at? Uh, seven and a half. Uh, it's fine. You get an angel moth, except that I don't want it. They're neat, but I don't want it like eating all my clothes, and I don't think they're smart enough to haul. No. They are cool, though. A six. You would be able to get it. I'll think about that for a couple of minutes. It would be kind of neat to have one as a pet, wouldn't it? I think so. Are these butchering? This is set to, yeah, just drop on the floor. Yeah, we've definitely got quite a bit of Aero Fleet, that's for sure. Did you guys get away from me when I wasn't paying attention? You did. Alright, alright, alright. Here, let's expand the zone so that more people can, like, haul things in. It's not good in terms of, like, being able to walk around, but I would like these inside. I mean, I'd like the bugs inside even more, but you get what you get. And the first person that walks by, Rose, good news. You get to finish off the Mega Spider and then haul it. Because I really need the insect meat. You've decided to ride over there. Okay, um, I disagree with your decision, but I respect it. Kind of. Mm. Crap. As I burn myself on my tea and lima beans, um, almost immediately has a new little sky eel. Welcome. Um, you're going to come into the safety zone, and you are going to stay there. Until you're much bigger. Cool. Welcome. I'll give you a name at some point. Probably. Alright, you made the bionic tentacle. Good, good. Um... Why is kibble... Oh, because... No, no, no. You shouldn't be starving. I don't really understand... Oh, because you're set to animals. <sighs> okay, that's my fault. That's entirely my fault. Aerofleets. Um, and not Serafina. Serafina can eat stuff. There. Correct? And that allows them access to kibble? Yes. Okay. I mean, I assume that they can eat kibble. I'm, I'm just, you know, jumping to that conclusion. And good, someone's working on the plasteel. I saw the bionic tentacle go by. So I just need to find Mort. And let's go ahead and let's add a tentacle. What do you think? First tentacle, second tentacle? I'm gonna go with first. That sounds cool. You're scanning, but why don't you uh, work on Mort, just in case. We're slowly catching up with like helmets and stuff like that. It's just taking forever. I added a second meat hook in here just to try to make that work a little better. 
Come on, Ravnak, don't screw this up. Looks like you did not. Cool. I'm not making you another one because they are too much money. Maybe someday when I'm absolutely drowning in money and I have nothing better to do with it. Anyway, who's got fire and nothing to do with their time? It's really too bad that nonviolence can't use Molotovs. And Mort is wandering in confusion. Okay, that's fine. You can't wander very far anyway. Thrombos, you say? Ooh, that's a lot of thrombos. We could take five thrombos, though. I'm pretty confident we could. Yeah, I'm definitely sure that we could. How long do we have on that quest? Ah, crap. You're not the quest button. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. One at a time here. World. Factions. Quests. Okay. Oh, I missed it. Okay, well, oh well. Cargo pods with apparel. Um, hyperweave pants, huh? Okay. A jungle blouse. Alright, alright, that's fine. Um, let's go ahead and let's kill a few minutes. I'd like those guys to spread out. I'd rather not deal with all five at once, but I could. I suppose. Oh, a grizzly bear is hunting us. Okay. Um, we're gonna put that on hunt. We're gonna desperately try to not, like, aggro these thrombos right now. It may happen anyway. There we go. You go ahead and you set that bear on fire. Drafted hunt. Yes. Still waiting to get a few more components for, um, making some other interesting guns. Nicely done. I mean, it's on fire, but even so, nicely done. Are you hauling it? Can you come haul it? Not you. Doodle, can you come haul this, please? Okay, it's, it's burning. Yes, that is true. So people are always saying things to me like, Dico, you're a monster. Look, fine. I'm building a crematorium. Fine. Stop complaining. We had a couple corpses here. Where did they go? Did somebody eat them? Well, and by somebody, I mean something. Of course. Haha. -ha. Um. We should get going on these thrombos if I want to do it. Let's bring everybody inside first. Um. Come on into your designated positions. And I can't remember if Aerofleet have their own... Not Doom. Although I could move Doom around. That would actually be fine. Let's do that. Clear allowed area, base. I know I had a spot for them at some point, but now I don't remember. They can just come up here. And is everyone back in the base now? Not yet. Oh, hello. A night ram. Okay. Um, well, obviously we need to come rescue that. And then I can switch everybody over. Maybe this is a bad idea doing that right now. Come on. Go, 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 go. I need you inside so I can switch all you guys over. Let you grab your guns and stuff, whatever. Major break risk. Yeah, I know. It's because I'm making you stand right there. Okay. Okay, I think everybody's kicked over. Who's got a nice long range gun? Um... Ah, you. <laughs> Using the punching bag. That's that's a good idea. However, we need you to come do something else instead. Something that nobody's going to love because it's killing thrombos. Medical emergency. Yeah, why why is nobody feeding you? All right. Actually, I should have some people already over in their drafted positions. I'm going to change a whole bunch of this too, by the way. I have a plan. It's just not implemented at the moment. Feel free to, like, one-shot it. That would be cool. Okay, there we go, Manhunter. Come back over here. I really wish you would dismount. Thank you. I don't know where you're going, but I guess that's fine. Okay, you've decided to go that way. I disagree with your decision, but I respect it. 
There we go. Okay, come on in. We should have no trouble with you. Oh, in fact, this is overkill. Yep. Um, okay. Or how are you doing? I don't want you to freak out. You're tired. But can we get one more, please? And then I'll let you go? What time is it? Oh, it's not that late. Oh, I should have had you grab one of these guys. Um, can you grab... Evan? That'll save us a lot of time. There we go, finally, my god. I'm starting to wonder if this thing was ever gonna go manhunter on us. You hit a trap, well that's annoying, but okay. And I think that two of these is gonna be plenty. Just because this is taking so long. And frankly, my people have better things to do. Who can I bring over that's in a good mood now? Not you. You'd be fine. You're not of any particular use. Um... Not a lot of good roles here, but we're pretty serious business. I hope. I guess we're about to find out. I'm just really trying to, like, leave people alone. If that makes any sense. Okay, good enough. And, uh, let's go ahead and let's set you guys all back to your regular clothes. Okay. Well, we got a couple of thrombos. Maybe I'll come get the rest, but that's actually quite tedious. Yeah, so I'm going to expand the wall here so I can put in some turrets. But I haven't quite decided how I want that to work. Rescued animal didn't join. Okay, well, where are you, rescued animal? Right here. Um, we can try to tame you. Oh, wait, what am I saying? Birdman. You still have inspired taming? Perfect. Good news, man. Uh, you... Are you set to handle? There, now you're set to handle way down at the bottom. Why don't you come grab... this thing. There we go. Welcome. Cool. Have a nocturnal or crepuscular animal. Ah, oh, that's neat. Where are you on here? Right down here. Um, you go ahead and just go normal. Fine. Credit a masterwork duster. That's awesome. Yeah, because I've got to dig up a bunch of graves here, so I might as well, uh... Might as well burn them. You know? Oh, yeah, I was going to keep sticking some of this royal jelly in people. Because apparently it goes away, and that's fine. Who has a very small injury? Kraus. Good news. Ish. You're gonna get a royal genome and hopefully it'll do something good. Or maybe it'll be something bad. We'll find out. Oh good, more eggs. This is good. Mutation outcome. And what did you get? I really like doing this to people. A pheromone secretor. Oh, that's cool. Okay, and who else should I experiment upon? Harry? Yes. Why not? Let's give you... Oh, I've got legs and stuff. Cool. Um, you got a warrior genome. Where'd the leg end up? Is it in here where it's supposed to be? Here it is. Cool. A mutant leg. This is covered in a slick secretion that constantly drips from every pore. Something seems off about it, as if it wasn't completely a natural creation. Yeah, that's cool. Oh, actually, I wonder if I should plunk that into Revnok. That's actually not a bad idea, because the psychic sensitivity. I mean, not that I remember to deal with the psychic sensitivity or train them or anything in any way like that, but... Oh yeah, I gotta turn this off. That's too much gas being used, alas. Yeah, I'm really not using things efficiently this time, am I? <laughs> oh, man. A venom gland, huh? A venom gland. Secretes acid. Cool. They can show the a short-range acid spitting attack. Cool. And yeah, let's put that leg on you. 
Um, because you're just hanging out. So good news, you get a weird mutant leg. How about a mutant right leg? Just because I think these are awesome. So come rest. And who's my next 99%? Actually, Birdman could try this out. Well, maybe I'd better have another frontline medic do it. <laughs> Not Birdman. Even Kraus is pretty good, right? Yeah, well, I'm mean, obviously not right now. Wait, hold on. I just said not right now because you're woozy, right? Yeah, no, bad. I appreciate the thought, but no. There we go. Yes. All right. Security for allies. Wait, was that the one? No. Oh, yeah. Yeah, this is the one that would be a nightmare if I take it. I think I'm still going to pass on that one. That just looks too messy. I don't know. I think that would be... I think that would be a mistake. What do we have for wildlife, by the way? i got some buffaloes. Uh-oh. Um... You're attacking a bear. At least you have a laser sword. Is there anybody nearby that feels like helping? Wow, kind of got your ass handed to you, buddy. Okay. Well, that's kind of awesome, actually. Well done. Oh, what else is going on here? I'm desperately trying to get people to make components. Having a really hard time with it, to be honest. And a Manhunter pack. Great Devourers, huh? They're actually not that big of a deal. Although, in this number, they probably are. Uh, let's bring everybody inside. Um, animal safety, which is animal safety for all of you. Uh-huh. And then everybody out here, come on into base. As such. And we shouldn't need to close many doors behind anybody. Just that one, I think. And hopefully no one's too far away. Uh, Wombat. Bad news, buddy. I think you're going to have to stay up there. Well, maybe not. Oh, it's going to be close. No, 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 that's right. There's a door up here. You're fine. Okay, well, we've got everybody inside, so let's just go ahead and let's just kill him. We can take this, no problem. Yep. Defense position one, please. There we go. Except for Birdman, you don't need to do anything. Man, I gotta get you guys some better guns. Man, these guys will be no problem. Oh, is that all of them? Okay. I was just having to switch guns because, um... This glorious piece of equipment right here... Uh, does not allow them time to, like, do anything. Like, the wind-up was so slow. It was pretty bad. And I think I actually need to modify this. What do you weigh? Eight kilograms. Yeah, no, this can be, this can be carried. Actually, can I just have you rock it? Yeah, cool. So I could have you switch back and forth. Okay, that's pretty neat. All right, you guys go back to normal. Um, animals, go ahead and go back to normal. Whatever you were at, it's okay. Do whatever. Um, it is a little disappointing. I can't just burn those right there easily. Hey, Starflight Basics. Yay. All right, so. Um, hmm. It's really tempting to go to hydroponics for rice, let me tell ya. It's really tempting. And I have all these other things, like, honestly, there's too much in here. <laughs> I didn't realize exactly how much I was getting into. Um, here, learn how to make an EMP cannon. And, like, I just haven't had time to do stuff. Like, I finally got my crafters, like, working on weapons again. I'm going to make a Gauss rifle, because I think that'll be cool. So apparently Gauss weapons do indeed work, um, like, they go through a target, so you can hit multiple targets. I haven't seen that, but that's cool, if so. I mean, I'll take your guys' word for it. Oh, and you're almost done with this medical book. Is this going to bring you up to 11? No. But that's okay. Yeah, launching the ship, blah, blah, blah. 
Everything's slowly being uh, brought out here, and then once they are, I'll burn them all or something. It would honestly be too much work to run them through the incinerator. New lovers. Tree tried to romance ham. Aww. Well, good news. Wait, tree and who? Ham. Where did that come from? Wow. Wow. I'm seriously tempted to change your name. Tree and Harry. Okay. Cool. Well, that's a disaster in the making. I love that. Um, Hawken, what are you working on at this exact point in time? Advanced components. Okay, that's fine. Yeah, some of these guns got stuck because I had advanced components set on 8 and some of them require 10. So, that kind of slowed things down a bit. But it's okay, we're doing well now. You're visiting a grave. Oh, that's perfect. Come on over here. Because I was just going to have you burn this giant pile of corpses. One shot. Now you can go ahead and visit graves. Did you see that cool trail? I don't know if I've ever seen that. Hide in a room. Fine. Hey look, an air fleet set itself on fire. Amazing. Oh my god, you finished up your medical book. Good job, man. I was really hoping that would bring you up to 11, but it didn't. But you know what? I don't care. Just go do whatever it is you want. Uh, let's keep hunting here. What do we have here? We have a coyote that needs to be taken care of. A couple of caribou, maybe? Sure. So, I've decided to let all meats go in here, except for fish. Oh! An infested spaceship! <laughs> no, actually, I have to wait for my aero fleet to divide again. How close are you to dividing? Nine days. I don't want to wait nine days. Well, I I guess I'm going to have to. Because I can't just waste these Aero Fleet, you know? Well, I could, but I shouldn't. How are things going, by the way? Things are not going super well. The problem is we're running out of gas for everything. I'm not precisely sure why. A, a masterwork laser minigun. Very nice. Someone had a really low quality laser rifle. That's okay. So who should rock a laser minigun? You know what, Ollie? Good news. I'm gonna give you a laser minigun. Why? I don't know. But I'm gonna do it. Because that sounds awesome. Well, I tell you what, like, I feel like more should have happened this episode, but things have been pretty chill. Um, we're going to have to wait a few more days until we get our air fleets fissioning again. And then I'm planning on doing exactly the same thing we did last time for the bugs, because that was really, really funny. But, looks like everything's going to survive now. Um, we've got at least one cool weapon made, and I guess we're just going to have to take a break. So, as always, thanks for watching. See you next time.